and minds, cultivating compassion, generosity, and patience and enthusiasm, and wisdom as you age and undergo the various ups and downs of life and transformation, and the paths of your love, joy, and equanimity. Do you? <laughs> your unease for the goodness of God is with you. So, are you ready to say your best? Uh, right here. children as they will soon be your children. It warms my heart. Mark, are you ready? Kimberly, growing up, I've always knew our lives would end up together. I would look at you when you were young and hope that you would feel the same. You truly are my best friend, lover, drinking buddy, wife to be. I look forward to any more adventures. <laughs> Love you, brother. <laughs> okay. Kim, do you promise to clarify your expectations to Mark? <laughs> Mark, do you promise to clarify your expectations to Kimberly? Oh, you do. Do you promise to make sure you're not just hungry before you uh, turn into Mr. Grumpy Pants? <laughs> I, I didn't hear that? I do. Okay, good. <laughs> And do you promise to do the stuff neither of you really want to do, like doing the laundry or dishes, but you got to do? Do you do? Do you promise to still love each other even if you get wickedly fat or wasting away, and to love each other even though things go south and you get your hair in unwanted places? Okay. So, by the power invested in me in the Universal Life Church in Saguaro, ma'am, I want to officially pronounce you husband and wife! Did anybody 
we object? I'm sorry. No, oh, I, I didn't want to say that because I knew somebody would. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you're welcome. Your box. Congratulations. I'm going like, wait a minute. <laughs> Thank you very much. Part two. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.